my name is Christopher Delgado. I work with Union Pacific. I'm a terminal operations foreman. And um, what I do with that is I help with uh, the planning at East LA. That's where I'm stationed at in Commerce. And um, I do all the, the planning in the yard in terms of where our inbound trains are gonna land and what assets we're gonna use for our outbound program. Uh, TCU has helped me a lot in terms of my success with the railroad, with uh, letting us know the pros and the cons of the union and um, the things that they expect of us in, in the transportation industry. And with some people, how they might feel that is strict here in TCU is a reality in the real world, such as you know not having your personal device, uh, substance abuse and stuff of that nature, um, to stay focused. Uh, attendance, which is really big in the transportation industry. It's crucial, the point system. Um, so that t the way the TCU has helped me a lot is provide the the skills I needed, like the office administration, that, that advanced skills I learned right here, the office etiquette, uh, you know, give me the training that what you expect in anything in transportation, uh, you know, how the union is. Um, the, and then I kind of like bounce back with what I do with as a foreman is how I mentioned, I do the planning, uh, but I also do payroll, I do overtime calls, I do job briefings, um, interviews. Um, I help coordinate the offense of all the departments, letting them know, you know, where to go, what needs to be done, what's critical, and come crunch time during train build, certain things that uh, just make first OS. If I gotta leave freight behind, I mean, big boy stuff, real big boy stuff. Uh, Advice for, for new students that I have would probably be is when you, when you first get into this program, don't do the bare minimum. When you make a mistake, just ask, okay, how, where did I go wrong? Learn from that mistake. And when you, when you, when you move forward, you want to keep that attitude of learning from your mistakes and seeing how to prevent them moving forward. I mean, because we, we all make mistakes. So even when we drop the ball, we just got to gotta go ahead and get back up and focus on the next play and keep on moving forward. And some advice I would have for new students would be just have that mindset of, of going above and beyond, always. I, mean, I don't know if you, for those of you who play sports, you know, keep every play like, like it's your last play. If you're not, if you're not into sports, Hard work works. When you go above and beyond, um, there are people watching in terms of seeing if you're being efficient, safe. Uh, that would be some of the advice I'll have. I mean, a little bit about me too is I'm a former high school dropout. I came with Job Corps, got my diploma here, got my advanced training here at LA Job Corps with TCU. And I exited with a, a Metroline job as a temporary CER uh, agent, customer engagement representative. And I saw Union Pacific was hiring. I applied, I got the job, started off as a regular clerk, uh, was on call my first eight months, got a schedule um, at East LA. When I went to that yard, I was furloughed for a bit. And when I returned back from being furloughed, hard work works. I got recognized and I got promoted. And my advice for the new students would be just to stay focused on the task at hand. You know, not everything's always going to be given to you. It has to be earned. Um, and just really is, think about it, you know, when you look in the mirror, that's the only person you're, that, that when it comes to Accomplishing things, the only person that's in, in your way is when you look in the mirror, is, is yourself. And there, there's no one else. Is your We are our own worst enemy. So if you think bad thoughts to yourself, you know, hey, you're not going to move forward. But if you have positive, positive, uh, positive, positive mindset, saying, you know, I, I don't want to be good, I want to be great. 
I want to do this, I want to do that, or no, I'm going to do this, I'm going to do that. Just that positive mindset, even on your darkest days, will help take you to the promised land. And never settle. Never, ever settle. Thank you. <laughs>